For the second time in 24 hours, it's hockey night here in Nottingham. This is game number six and the final matchup in our international four-pack challenge sponsored by Internet Motor Parts. This time, the opposition are Mac Budapest from Hungary. This Hungarian side narrowly beat Pete Russell's Glasgow clan last night in a close encounter which had the Scottish fans on the edge of their seats. Brendan Colony's late leveller took the clan into the extra period, but Jared Brown's overtime strike for the Hungarians saw them take the win. He could be one to watch tonight. Panthers go into the game hoping to keep their unbeaten run intact, and last night's 5-3 victory over the Oilers once again underlined that there's no shortage of goals in this Nottingham Panthers side who've hit the net 25 times in five games. Mac Budapest are here tonight with the intention to take the shine from an otherwise textbook preparation ahead of our huge Challenge Cup game next Saturday against the Sheffield Steelers. The highlight show is brought to you in association with the legend, Nottingham's number one family-friendly hockey pub. It's time to watch the action. Nice play there by Tetlow to clear the zone and now Guptill, he's isolated though. Guptill now, nice play by him in front. Her to be there. Couldn't get it on there. Now we have an odd man rush the other way. Oh, I just couldn't quite execute it. Now the Panthers have an odd man rush the other way. Three, four on one here. In front of Guptill. Back to Billingsley. Shot. And it's going to be in from Herchabees. He had one last night. He gets another one inside the first five minutes tonight. Great play by Kovacs, Guptill, and then Billingsley. And he finds Herchabees with a simple tap in. Panthers lead by one goal to nothing. So we'll stay five on four here for another 35 seconds. Now Orban down the wing. He looks in front. Good chance here. Shot. Huge save by Sam Gospel. His best save of the game so far with the glove. And he keeps this one at one nothing. And now they come forward with Henderson. He joins the rush here. Henderson looking back door in front of Kovacs. He shoots. Nice save there. Kovacs with a great chance to double the lead, but a huge save. This one remains 1-0. 8.08 to go in the first period. All turnover there in front. Panthers survived that scare, though. Now Biggs. 2-1-1 on one the other way here. Shot come in, and it's in. A shot from a, uh, a tight angle there. And that's the number 10. Orden there with the goal, came down on a two-on-one, Stevie Lee took the uh, passing option away, but he fires low to the glove of San Gospel, nice shot just over the pad. And with 3.41 remaining in the first period, Mac Budapest tied the score. Though 24 and a half seconds left on this first period, tied at one. Nice play by Lakovic, he gets to that puck first, up to John Rowe. Rowe in, shoots and scores. John Rowe scores, and he's hot this weekend. Two goals yesterday, and another one so far tonight. Lakovic wins his battle, gets to the puck first, and he springs John Rowe, and he goes high glove, makes no mistake. And with 4.7 seconds left in the first, the Panthers lead by two goals to one. Nice play in front of Kelso. Kelso rips on that, comes off the shorts. Shot from Betches from a bad angle, just wide up to the blue line. Now Biggs, he's going to step in and rip one. Deflection in front, and that's in from Oli Betcheridge. Great hands there from Betches in front and out. Biggs fires in the hard shot from the slot. First save by the goalie. Oli's on the spot, picks up the rebound. Round the net miner and fires into the empty net. Panthers lead 3-1. Now a big hit there by Stevie Lee. Now Brown comes in. He gets forced down to the boards. Nice play there by Henderson and Kovacs. Now back to the point. Budapest control the play with Dudas. Dudas fires one in. But Henderson's first to that one. And now the Panthers come forward. They got three forward to Herchabees in the start. Herchabees to Guptill and it's in off the netminder. I think Guptill was trying to go back door. It doesn't matter anyway. It's in the net. 7.44 remain in the second. Great play by Herchabees to dish back to Guptill. 
Gupta trying to go back door, gets a deflection off the netminer and it's in. Panthers lead, four goals to one. He just deflects it up and out the zone. Shot coming in, easy save there from Gospel. Oh, rebound there, and that one's in, and the puck jumps up. Gospel goes out to grab it. It takes a bad bounce right in front of him. Complete misfortune there. It bounces, hits the pad, and it's right on a plate there for the empty net tapping. Nice play by Budapest, looking back door to Klemper. Puck just jumped over his stick. Now turnover there behind the net gives Budapest a chance to re-attack. Netminder still in for Budapest. Garat throws that one in just wider than that. Budapest just trying to get something going here in front. In front to Klemper, shot, rebounds there. Great save by Gospel. Huge save there. That could be the one that ends up winning this game. Herchebis, great job of getting that puck out to Kovacs. He has Biggs driving the back door. He puts it into Biggs. Biggs gets a piece of it. I'm not sure if the netminder made a save there. He just fired it wide. Now Kovacs, he forces a turnover. He finds Pitha. Pitha shoots. Nice save again by the netminder. Two big saves from him to keep his team in this one. But it looks like we're 21 seconds left. Panthers going to end pre-season undefeated. I'm joined by Panthers forward Mark Herchbees. Mark, great end to the preseason with another victory for the Panthers. What do you make of the six games we've played so far? Uh, I, th I thought, you know, we uh, we had a game plan and we're trying to work through our game plan, you know, get ready for the season. And I thought we executed pretty well. You know, there's still room to grow. We uh, we had great results and we just want to keep building on that. And it's great to see, obviously, the likes of, you know, Sam Gospel and Joe Hazeldean getting regular shifts and you can kind of see them start to develop. Yeah, absolutely. They played great tonight. Sam played great and Hazel did his job even more than he was asked to. He was really good. And yeah, it's great to see those young kids uh, get a little experience here before the season. And goals for you in back-to-back -back games, you're starting to find your feet as a Panther. Yeah, you know, I feel a bit better now. It took me a couple of games here to get, uh, you know, my feet underneath me, but uh, starting to feel better. And uh, it's just like the rest of the team. I just want to build off uh, this regular, uh, this off season and uh, bring into the regular season. And then moving on, obviously those games are out of the way now. First proper competitive game Saturday against Sheffield should be a huge one, obviously massive rivalry. Yeah, we're all excited for that. You know, we're going to take a few days off here, get uh, get set for that and have a good week of practice and, uh, you know, the boys will be ready. And this is your second stint in the Elite League. I know it's not quite the rivalry when you're up in Edinburgh, but what do you remember about the Steelers from back in the day when you used to play against them? Uh, they were a good team then and I'm, I'm sure they're still a good team now, you know. Uh, you know, I think it's. I know this league has changed a lot, so you know I'm looking forward to see uh, what uh, what type of team they have this year. Awesome! Well, thanks for joining us, and good luck for the weekend. Thank you.